run? You said. Ooh. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, hey, Yana. Are you ready? Yeah. Guys, when you hear, are you ready? Do you immediately hear the Zoe 101 song after? <laughs> Zoe 101 theme song lyric. I can't find Zoe 101 in your music. We're over this. Okay, well, you always understand. Hey guys, what's up? It's Kinsey. Today I'm here with my BFF, bestie girly number one, Yama. Oh my best friend, but bestie girly, wait no, gr girly cat, BFF. I number one. I am so embarrassed that I messed that up. What? Bestie cat? Is that I'm so sense? embarrassed right now. I'm not embarrassed that that's what we call each other. I'm just embarrassed that I messed it up. You know when you start saying things ironically and they become your vocab? That's exactly how it is. That's where we're at. It's really embarrassing. Okay. You guys are new here, subscribe. Also follow us on Instagram. Also, we're very cool and we're going to start showing it, so, thank you. You don't tell them that. You can't let them know. Cool. No. Uh, okay. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> okay. I guess we're not. Yeah, we're just um, like, no. Yeah, no. Okay, it's first effortless. It's effortless. effortless. It's effortless. It's effortless. We don't try. Yeah. We don't have this collection saved on our Instagram. No. We don't no. Board. no. Uh, merch, check it out. Link down below. Anyways, oh. we asked you some questions on Instagram. Like I said, follow us on Instagram. Um, and we're just gonna start off with something like Yeehaw or Hoggy. You yeehaw, would be, yeehaw. No, 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 no. You would no. be a Hoggy. No. You know that you are too. You're just covering it up. You are a Hoggy. I'm trying to be a Yeehaw, but. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm a Yeehaw. Let's just a hoggy. Yeah, let's do. Yeah, you know, we complete each other. When did y'all meet? Take it away, Yana. I met her in your apartment in downtown. I met you. Do I talk to you or them? I'm like both. They're like a friend. Imagine like someone sitting there, I think. Oh, is that, is that like, I mean, I don't no, know. Just, oh. I met you, her. I don't know what I'm doing. Just, just say something. Okay. I'll, I'll do it. No, you can be fine. Go ahead. So, it was like around New Year's of 2015 going into 2016 and Joe and Sean were staying with me in my apartment. My, like, First apartment. I no. Think, right? No. Th this was after that. So like they were, no, they weren't staying with you. They just slept over one night for that thing, for the, for the New Year's Eve. And then a couple days later we came back with- So around New Year's Eve. Oh, without me. When you came over and they were with us and we hung out. Well, we were all together. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay. But I'm just saying like, I knew Joe and Sean. And, and we filmed that video with Andrew. That was the first day we ever met. With you, Joe. It was Joe. And Andrew. Oh yeah. You, me, Andrew, Sean, Joe. Yeah, so we go way back. Damn. It's only been two years? That doesn't sound right. But it is right. That's so weird. No, because it's about to be 2019. Yeah. So it's been three years, three years. Yeah, we're okay. going around three years. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That makes more sense. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, I'll, but I'll like roughly, on. roughly two years if you... Uh, but like, my roughly my 17 my years. No, no, I aged 17 no, years no. in this friendship. No, no, no. <laughs> minus, <laughs> minus the good year. We we weren't friends. Four, Plus a, a couple others, right? Um, mm -hmm. Then we've known each other for two years. Yeah, we had a little a bit of a falling yeah, out. A falling out. Mm -hmm. You know what I was thinking about? I was in the car and I didn't say it because I was going to save it for the video, like you asked me to. Okay, you know when you're like dating someone or like you like see someone and you're like, oh, like not now, but like maybe later or whatever, and it like is never really later and you just get over them by then. Yeah. It's kind of like that, but it, we're the case where it worked or we're not dating. Like, oh, we actually, I think we're actually, actually good yeah, to yeah, each yeah, other yeah. rather than her. Because we definitely were like, not now, but like maybe later, and then maybe later happened. Yeah. 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 But it won't always happen, so don't count on yeah, it. Yeah, don't count on it. If it's a boy, move on. Yeah. No, or even a friend. Like, sometimes it really just yeah. means like, let go. Yeah. So. Basically, we just took a break. Did we talk about why we, why we fell out? Yeah, what would you even say? What's your reasoning? Um, no, genuinely, no, yeah. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I, I had a falling out with a mutual friend of ours, and then, well, I know this isn't the reason, but, yeah, but it was my reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was my reason, because then we fell out, and I was like, oh, I blamed it on the fact that me and this other person fell yeah, out. Yeah, but it wasn't It wasn't that, that at all, yeah. and then once we re But I also, I later, didn't communicate that with yeah, you at all. And I will say, this was, this was, at the end of it, I feel like, because normally I am, like I'm especially now like we've gotten a lot better at handling conflicts and I'm like a lot better at like having conversations and whatever. But at this yeah, point we, we just totally we just like, didn't have a conversation. Yeah. But also I will say like at this point I was so anti gossip and talking poorly of anyone. Yeah, and that's that, all I was about. Well, that's not what I was gonna say, something well, else. No, but I wouldn't um like 
because of that, if I had issues, I wouldn't like talk about it with anyone. Oh, advice, I, so, like, I wouldn't like go through it. I just like bottled everything up. And then at the end of it, when you guys had that falling out, I was just like, whatever. Because yeah. of that, you see what I'm saying? I, I so like if I would have just like realized it wasn't gossip and it was like something that would have been beneficial for our friendship and like yeah. talked about to someone to get advice and then go from there. Like by the time I was like, okay, we should talk, it was just too late. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, definitely. So we took a break. I was at 10. Yeah. 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 I was, it's like so weird. If you would have told me then that you were like my number one, like y'all did was more like no same. You were the only yeah, person I tell yeah. everything to. Like yeah. he, like I immediately call y'all. Like if you would have told me that then, I would have yeah. never believed it. I wouldn't believe. I would have never believed that we could go to this after that. Happened. It's like we're like ride or die. Like I'll, yeah. I'll murder someone for. I'll, I'll literally swim for the car. <laughs> I didn't even meet, um, you couldn't even block his name up, but I didn't even meet I just knew. 
like uh, g given probably everybody did too but i just knew i think you knew before i know <laughs> I think everyone knew before I knew. That's me and boys. I never know. Yeah. And then, so I'm like, no, I don't like them. But that's such a great quality to have. Cause... Really? Yeah. Well, because, like, would you rather be obsessed with every boy ever? Do you know what I mean? And, like, yeah. No, I'm not. You waited for them to, like, be completely and utterly obsessed with you before you... Yeah. Absolutely. That's what I do. Yeah. That's what I do. Before it's you like even think about it. liking them. <laughs> yeah, why do you consider it? Like... <laughs> Yeah, I'll be like, no, like, I really don't like them. But I genuinely mean that at the time. And then I... There's a lot of times that I say that though and I don't end up liking them. But just like, pretty yeah. much, yeah, you know, like I also don't like you all, but yeah. You did know about that one. What would you do if you ever caught someone using Texas's name in vain? I would just pray for them. I would throw hands. <laughs> must not respect themselves to, to say Texas name in vain. That's really embarrassing. What is a topic you can't talk to each other about? I can't think of one. What is that? Don't you we can't talk to each other about? I literally can't think of anything. Before I would have said boys. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. But now I wouldn't, obviously. For, on my side, not on yours. Cause... Yeah, but like, I wouldn't have oh, you opened wouldn't it have up to you the same way had you That's not. true, that's true. What is your favorite thing about each other? Go first. <laughs> the obvious that people say are probably like, your, you work hard, you're dry, dry, outgoing, blah blah blah. You work, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, your people would say like your drive, optimism, blah blah blah. I would say my favorite thing about you, you play devil's advocate more than I do, and I really appreciate that because you really see all sides of things. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? I mean, you might not even say it though. I can just tell. Like, yeah. if, if she's say this is rare, but say she's talking shit on somebody, and I jump in and I start talking shit on that somebody, she would be like, "Wait, but like, it's that's so true. true. That's so true. true. Like, you'll you'll say something nice about them, <laughs> <laughs> so I don't have to talk about. You know what I mean? And then you like switch it up, and then we start talking about the nice things about them, like it, because it's it's so hard for you to like have. You know what I mean? Just, yeah. Because it, it's hard sometimes to see the other sides of things, and you. Definitely do that. Yeah, you're good. Like I, when I go to Yana, I'm like, like I always say, like I would rather be wrong than be right because if you're in the wrong, it's easier to like work from there, yeah. like to work up if you're wrong than it is when you're right. That's true. Like it's so much easier because yeah. you have almost more control, like not like control in a power way, but control in like a, I can make this better way. Yeah. Because I'm the one who messed up. Like so, I can I have to be the one that make the difference, you know. So I always say like I would rather be wrong. But when I tell Yana something, but then it's like, like sometimes, tell me. but. It, Sometimes it's like it's hard when to know it's hard to know when to be supportive versus when to be devil's advocate. That's yeah. sometimes it's hard. You know what I mean? Like, should you be like, yeah, like in full support of something, or should you make them see that they might be wrong? You just never know yeah. sometimes. But you definitely do a good balance of it, I think. And I think I do too. You do too, yeah. yeah. You do too. Maybe with you, I don't know. With other people, you know. <laughs> you're very loyal. Oh my god. No, but you're like right. Like you're every like, time you say that, I can picture somebody that I wasn't loyal to be like. I don't remember no. their names. I don't so know. Anyways, it's very loyal. Like you're very like stable in things. If that makes sense. Okay. Like if you're in a friendship, you're in. It. You're very like long. I see. We're in a long yeah. run. Yeah. Rather I can't, than I can't do like a. Yeah, you're not. Yeah, I don't. We're I mean. both. Yeah. We're both pretty intense yeah. people. So yeah. like, it's either like forever or never. Yeah. Basically. If I call you and I'm like messed never. up about something, you're just very stable. Like you're very and like stable in my life and also stable in how you talk to me about things. Mm -hmm. Like you, you will get worked up with me, but in the mm -hmm. when you should get worked up with me, mm -hmm. it's kind of the same thing you were saying. But like. Mm -hmm. I immediately am like, like sometimes I'll like just audio message her like something that happened in like two minutes like we don't need to talk about this but just so you know because if this comes up in a week and something else happens it's yeah, easier yeah, to keep yeah, you in the loop. Yeah, that's but, true. But yeah, you're stable. Most of the time I, I know that I might not, re well you even know that I might not reply, you know what yeah, I mean? Cause yeah. I can, because if I just did that, it Because a lot of the time, yeah, I feel like we're really good about not egging each other yeah, out. Yeah, oh things. yeah. Like I feel like we've gotten really good Definitely. at that. Definitely. Because I'll be like, Definitely. oh, yeah. But like, I know when to be like, bitch, what? Yeah. Like, and I know when to be like, Okay. Like there was something that happened like a few weeks ago that I really saw any of my friends and I knew they'd be really mad But I was like, okay, Yana, here's what happened. But like I knew like uh, <laughs> What was it? The, the Oh, right. See? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Okay, this didn't happen and I didn't No, she, but she 
she waited. She waited a little bit to tell me because she. I waited to tell anyone really because it was like messed up. Yeah. And I knew that my friends would get really worked up about it, and I honestly like wasn't super worked up about it, even though I probably should have been, kind of thing. And then yeah, I just like, but I, I just like made my decision and I moved on from that. Like it wasn't. It's good that she waited to tell me because if she told me in the moment, I would have gotten so furious. I'm yeah. still furious. I'm still mad. Sorry. Yeah. Unforgivable, <laughs> boy. Sorry. We all, we love everyone. Yeah. We're really on exactly. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Kenzie, do you love the chase as much as Yana? I love the chase more than Yana. Oh, okay. Hmm. Do you not like that answer? I'm just you know, trying to be supported. I fucking hate Kenzie Elizabeth, but have you heard a podcast? <laughs> Chick fil A sauce or ranch? You can only pick one, go. Chick fil A ranch. sauce. Wait, what? <laughs> you would be the dying. We're 30 minutes in. Well, no, listen, if there's some questions, because some questions might be boring. Yeah, you know, that's maybe true. Yeah. Is it sometimes hard to make time to see each other in person? Absolutely not. No. Dream boy, your dream boy, but my dream boy for you. This, it's because you are so emotionally stable and secure non-emotionally secure boys yeah. Latch on yeah. you know what I mean? Why not? Yeah, because they're like she's gonna help And you do that's, you do yeah, but it's not good. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's definitely not good. Thank you. That was good Yeah, what I about know. me because I, I, I want to know Mark Ruffalo. Oh, no, you have to know literally Mark Ruffalo But like younger and yeah. not Mark Ruffalo. Oh my god. I would love that <laughs> Love. Whoever you're with is supposed to bring you closer to everything in your life, like God, your calling, and your friends, and everything. Like they're supposed to bring you closer to that. They're not. And the second that they're like isolating you, yeah. it's really bad. And, okay, what's your favorite thing about your friendship? I have mine. Okay. I like how we're both like very creative in the sense of like ex like I feel like we're both like pretty expressive. But I feel like when we're like creative together and we like bounce ideas, like we don't do the same thing. Yeah. But it's cool to like. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I like. I think one thing I've always been, and one thing I was before I like changed emotionally who I was from two years ago. I've always been super, super involved in other people's creative projects. Just, I love it so much. Sometimes I'm even more passionate about that, which is why I didn't do music for so long because I was so concerned like with what everybody else was doing. I almost push people too much. Like no, that's what I mean though. Like I like that we're involved, especially like when all these songs come out. Like that's probably more exciting for me. Yeah, more yeah, exciting yeah, for you. Like yeah, that's how excited I am. Like, I'm so yeah. excited. Podcast yeah, like stuff like that. Like we're very and that's another thing I was thinking about just the past like few months like I feel like things have not been changing in my life It's just been like I don't know how to describe it. It's, just been, like, it's been a good time. But it's been like a really weird time But but that's what I always say. I'm like I'm so grateful because at the end of the day Like you can take whatever from me, but I still have like my friends Like yeah. I still have the safety of that like yeah. I can always go back. I'm like Yana is always there Like I'm like I ultimately still not like win in the sense of like a competition against anyone like not like that at all But like at the end of the day, I still have that and that's like my like like the Covering like my like safety net, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, so I'm it's like kidding. a very like reliable Thing. It's great. And there's definitely been times, I think, in both of our lives when we didn't feel like there was yeah. somebody who, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, it's just funny that it ended up being each other. Yeah, I know. We yeah, were there. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. When is your next song, Yana? When is this coming out? Soonish, right? Mm -hmm. The thing is, here's my dilemma. Here's my dilemma, guys. I wrote the song. I have them. No, she <laughs> does. So she's not waiting for it. Yeah. <laughs> a couple of days They're ago. They're really good. No, yesterday. Yesterday, I wrote a song called Call Me Back. And. I love it so much that if I had my own way, like j I would want to do it. Like I don't even give a fuck about Christmas. Like yeah. I just want it out, but I don't know what to do. Like I don't know if I'm overstepping my bounds. Like contacting people, you know what I mean. So if any of you guys do music, hit her up. Yeah, seriously. How do you handle fighting with your best friend? Okay, well this is subjective because I would handle fighting differently with other type of people. You know what I mean? With you. I think I care about our friendship too much to let anything become a problem. So. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, now we're just so like almost mature in yeah. our friendship that like things don't ever get to that no. point anymore. That, yeah, that's I would probably say it. Like, not being offended, not holding on to offense, also having conversations early on 
and realizing that if it's like drop your pride that's the biggest thing yeah. like pride you've helped me the most with that i think though i feel like if i didn't have you in my life i would take things more personally more of the time yeah you know what yeah. i mean just because i see how you you lead by example you don't you don't get offended too often and it's it doesn't make me think oh i shouldn't get offended but it makes me think oh how important are these things that i'm getting yeah, that mad at you know what i mean yeah i think also it's like realizing that you guys are like on the same side like you're on yeah. the same team like that's yeah. what i would say like in the conversations that I've had the past few months, like that's when I'm like, we're like not with you, like just in general, I'm like we're on the same team. Like and nothing want, is ever as malicious as you make it seem. Yeah, exactly. Like we want the same thing, we want the same angle. So yeah. it's like we're on the same yeah. team. Like lower every, it's like not that big a video. Yeah. Like don't view the other person as like your enemy, like it's your best friend. It's like yeah. you want the same thing. Because I definitely had friends in the past that I didn't that did that did not make me my best. I, I wouldn't say that they suck. But they made me suck. This is this is the biggest difference with my friendship when it was before versus now. Yeah. Is before I felt like held back almost yeah. in a sense of like I felt like I was held to the person that I was like months before. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Like right now, and that's not like you, that's yeah. a lot of like yeah. internalized yeah. things. Yeah. Because like you change and then you feel like whatever. That's a big thing with you right now. I don't feel like I can't change. Like if, yeah, I, if I'm that's... walking your house tomorrow morning and I'm completely different. I 100% know that you'll be fine with it. You won't yeah. be like, that's not you. That's yeah, exactly. Not you. You know that's what I'm saying. Now I feel like I can be, yeah. Yeah. Whoever. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's like probably the biggest thing. What have we learned the most from each other? Dude, it's the whole offense thing. 100%. Yeah. I would say because now it even affects how I interact like with my family even. Yeah. Like, like, for example, like my mom. Love you. If she, I can do that. Love you. <laughs> I love you. And so I like can't do that. We've talked about this before. But it's moving on. Just right. straighten your wait. Just, so just so straighten your middle fingers. Just straighten your middle fingers. Straighten your maybe your yeah. You got it. Stupid. Yeah. But I get reminded just by having conversations with you that it's not that deep. It's not that deep. Not I that say that all the time. Yeah. Like it's not that deep. It really it's isn't that deep. deep. Not yeah. everything is about. And not everything is exactly what it is in your head. Like some people think. So much, and by some people, I literally mean me. It's me. I think so much, and it, it's, it's you're like, so much better about that now, though. Like, I, yeah. I try to be, but think being in my head a lot is like my biggest, biggest flaw, and it's gonna be the one thing in my life that I want to constantly work on. And I just think that if if you just don't think, if you don't tr like put so much value on your thoughts, it doesn't fucking matter. You know, value on your emotions. That's like, like well, yes. emotionally yeah. versus logically. It's like built up my faith in like people and reconciliation and friends. Like that's what I always say. Like when I think of like that will never happen, you never know what's gonna happen, or like or like people like changing your grind or people like whatever. Like now, the last thing I ever want to say is like, oh, never again. Because like if you would have told me that like, we would be this close, yeah. then I would have never believed you. Yeah. So it's like built my faith up in reconciliation growing as people for both of us like all like it ended up working out at the end of the yeah. day oh. so like but like it really was like probably my most extreme case of like a friend falling out like yeah. ever oh. not that it was like that was screaming, well, yeah. but it was just like quiet both of you for me was that yeah. the most for yeah, sure for sure case. and so like i think yeah at the end of the day like it's really and that's something that like literally like every single day i say it all the time like you really don't know what's gonna happen. Like yeah. you really just don't know. Now we're forever BFFs, yes. and Yana can't leave my side, even though like, apparently there is an afterlife to our friendship. So I'm still moving past that. We're gonna take care of you for that. Love you guys so much. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Watch our vlogs, Instagram. Wait, we don't have a um. We don't have a uh, a hashtag? hashtag. No, not a hashtag. Yinzi? No, but that's cute. No, Kana. Kana. That makes it sounds like Tony. Ken. Ken. Ken Kenza. It'd be Yinzi. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. yeah, that's cute. Hashtag Wait, no, Genzi. Genzi. Love you guys so much. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry that it was so long, but you guys like longer videos on my channel normally. So, peace out. I hate me.